Hi everybody, this is a video of me, my name is Thomas, I'm from Denmark and uh, I'm making a video on how to make uber leather for shaving. <coughs> now, the first thing I do is I put a kettle on and I boil some water and this water I'm gonna put into a big cup like this and onto this cup I'm gonna put my bowl I just want enough water for it to touch the bottom but not flow over on the sides because when I hold it in lather I might burn my fingers so I'm just gonna get the right amount in there and that's just gonna sit there heat up the bowl so I'll get a nice warm lather I have a little uh, yeah, it's actually for milk when you drink coffee, but uh, I find it useful in shaving this little uh, can here. And uh, this is just for excess uh, hot water if I need to add water during my lather. I have my coconut soap here. And I'll take this boiled water and I'll just add a tiny little bit here, like that. Normally I wouldn't hold it in my fingers like this, but I have to show it for the camera, of course. I'll let that sit in there and soak for a little while. I'll warm up my brush. Now for this I'm not going to use boiling water because I heard that it can damage the hair. I don't know if this is, is true or not. Please feel free to comment on everything in the video, as I am always interested in learning more about lathering and straight shaving in general. I'm not actually going to soak it in water, I'm just going to run more up, throw it a lot, rinse it out a little bit, like that. Now here I have something I bought yesterday, it's called shaving cream, it's from a company called The Art of Shaving, and it contains lemon essential oils. Now normally I hate everything that has a lemon scent or citrus or whatever because I think that uh, it often it smells way too chemical like an E number or something but um, this thing I mean when you open it up and you smell it man it's like there's a tiny little lemon tree in there or something I mean it has a great smell it's subtle it's not sharp it's not overpowering and it just smells like real citrus like like a real lemon is squeezed in there now I'll take a little bit of that, like this, put it into my cup here, like that. I'll take the soap, pour off the water, like that. And here I have glycerin. Now, of course, I put it into this container because I feel it's easier to adjust this way. Uh, the glycerin I bought came in a bottle, and if you're going to pour that, you might get too much. So I found that just by having it like this, you can just press it and just get a little bit out of the time. And I think that also it looks good, of course. So now I have my soap water, my shaving cream, and my glycerin, and now I'm just going to get a little bit of soap off of the brush, like so, and now I'm ready to lather. See, now it's just foam, not leather yet, I mean, that's, that citrus smell, oh my god, I would never, I wouldn't buy stuff like that on the internet because I'd just be afraid to get some chemical crap smelling of 
200 E numbers, but I found this in a store and I actually had the, the opportunity to smell it in the store and I was just sold on the spot. I mean, the stuff just smells really, really good. Now I've created a nice lather, it's almost done. And there it is, the Uber lather. Now this, when I put it in here, I'll just let it sit here and rest. It's warm. It's not going to get cold. This is really nice warm lather. I just could use a little bit more of lathering. It looks a little wet actually. I'll just lather it up some more. Normally I wouldn't do this in my hand. It's just for demonstration purposes. I mean this thing, man that feels like whipped cream. It's so nice. And that's the Uber Lather. I hope you enjoyed it. Maybe you can use it. And please feel free to post any comments. Thank you.